If you're looking to make a new website, I wanna show you five of the easiest and most popular platforms available right now. Some of them even let you use AI and type in a sentence and it will create the website automatically. Okay, the first one on the list I have is called Hostinger. Now, Hostinger takes care of multiple different things for you. So when you create a website, you need three things. You need a domain name, so that's gonna be the name of your website up top. So this is hostinger.com, for example. And some of these website platforms have that too, so you could get it all in one place. This has that too. The second thing you need is a place to host your website. So that's kind of a cloud server that they provide you, so your website is sitting on some kind of a host. And this is one of the platforms that also includes that. And the third thing you need is the actual website builder. So you could customize your website. This has that too. A lot of the ones I'm gonna show you have all those three different things all in one. And with Hostinger, there's multiple ways you can make a website. So for example, you could make a WordPress website. WordPress is very popular. Over 40% of all websites on the internet are built on WordPress. So this lets you in one click create that over here but they also have this Hostinger website builder. I'm gonna show you this one because this is really easy to use. And if you wanna sell something on the internet, we have some other options for that like Shopify that I'm gonna show you in a little bit, but they do have a e-commerce website builder too. So if you're trying to do that, this is the one you'll choose. But let me show you this one right here. Now, once you sign up, it brings you to this page. I'll talk about pricing at the end of each of the ones that I'm gonna show you too. And I also have dedicated tutorial on every single one that I'm gonna show you. So. This video is gonna be a quick overview of each one. And then if you wanna dive deeper and build a website, just watch the full tutorial on the one you get to pick here. So under the website tab here inside of Hostinger, you could create different websites. I'm creating a bunch of different websites here and you could create like a hundred different websites under the same plan. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a website. Again, you could do a WordPress one or you could do a Hostinger website builder. I'm gonna choose that one. This is an AI powered website builder here. Okay, on top, you put in your brand name, so your business name, and then you could describe your project here. And then it's gonna create the website here using AI. I'll just show you exactly how this works. Okay, that took maybe 10 seconds, and I got a website here completely built with AI. I could go ahead and change the colors here if I want to. Let me actually choose this one I like. And you could see it's created a headline for you. It created all these different sections of the website. It has animation and it's 100% customizable. So if I just press continue, I could just double click and change this, for example. It has an AI writer built into all these different sections. If you wanna change an image, you could just click on it. You could generate using AI or you could edit image and you could actually edit the existing image. You could add your own images, all kinds of things that are available. You could add your own sections and you have a ton of different tools on the left side, and then when you're happy, you basically connect it to a domain, which as I mentioned, that's your website URL. You could get that from here. They make you a temporary domain over here and you just go live. So I'm gonna go ahead and preview this one. This is what the people are gonna see. And look at this, it even has multiple different pages here that are all fully customizable. So you obviously wanna take some time customizing it, but in 10 seconds, you get this far based on that simple text prompt and then you could go from there. So one of the easiest ways to make a website, let me show you the pricing. And this is the plan I have, this is the pricing page. So $3 a month, right? This is if you pay long-term. So typically if you're building a website for your business, you just wanna do it long-term anyway. And this has all the different things I showed you. And sometimes some of these platforms give me a discount code that make it even cheaper. So I'll include everything that I have as far as discount codes go in the description below this video too. So you sign up for this, and then if you want to use Hostinger, again, watch my entire tutorial on that. But let me show you some other options because they might be a better fit for you. Next, I'm going to show you Wix. Wix is one of the most popular website builders in the world, and it's really easy to use also. So let me log into my account here. Now, this is what Wix looks like on the back end of Wix. I'm going to go ahead and create a new website here. And I'm gonna use Wix Studio here to show you this is the easier way to do it. Now, the difference between Hostinger, for example, and Wix, Wix is for one website. So you pay for one website. This is not a hosting platform where you can have a lot of different websites under the same plan. So this is really best if you just wanna create one website. You can create multiple websites, but you'll pay for each one separately. And this has a bunch of different options for you to create one. So you could start with a template with a blank canvas or with the editor. This one, the template is actually one of my favorite options because they have a ton of different ones available. So if you wanted to, for example, do a portfolio website, you could start with one of these and then fully customize it from there. And they have a ton of different 
templates available. You could search on top for one over here. And then let's say I like this one right here. I'm gonna go ahead and click on it to edit it. And it brings you inside of the website builder where here, again, you could click on anything that you see like this image, for example, you could go ahead and add a new image here to replace that image. You could double click on any text and right in here, you could go ahead and edit that text and type in whatever you want. And they do have some AI options too. So if you wanna create text with AI, you could go ahead and click this. This is gonna bring this up where you just type in your business type and so on, and it will create different text for you using AI. And again, all these sections are customizable. So pretty much any website builder you'll see is designed similarly when it comes to editing. You'll have all these different things on the left side that you could edit with. And then if you press the plus sign, you could add all kinds of different things to any of the templates that you get to choose. And then you could go ahead and preview the website on top. And I usually recommend when you do build websites, always check the mobile view to make sure it looks good on the mobile view as well. And also tablet view too. You wanna typically check, they usually have something on top to let you see it in different platforms. And then when you're happy, just press publish. And this also will give you a free domain that looks like this or you could connect to your own customized domain. Now, Wix does give you a domain as well, but here you could connect to one you bought already. So godaddy.com, for example, is a place where you could just buy domains. They're also a website builder too. So I'm gonna show you that too. They do the hosting, they do all the other stuff too. So all these are really easy because they have everything included in one bundle. You don't have to mix and match, but if you did want to, if you already had an existing domain, you can link it over here. Now, this is the plan for Wix. It starts at $17 a month. You get a free domain for a year. Domains are usually like a $10 a year value, but if you buy it from somewhere else, like GoDaddy, for example, it's somewhere like that, $10, $12. So you're getting that with this plan. And this is the one I had, this business plan that lets you invite more people. It has more storage here, so you could upload videos and things like that. And this lets you accept payments and things for e-commerce if you're going this route too. And again, I have a full dedicated Wix tutorial if you wanna go that route. Let's go to the next one. Okay, next on the list is GoDaddy that I just mentioned. So GoDaddy's been around for a very long time. And I usually bought my domains from GoDaddy. I have a ton of different domain names on GoDaddy. And recently they rolled this out right here. This lets you create websites using AI, really simple also. So with GoDaddy, the first thing you typically do is you buy yourself a domain. So you search for a domain, if it's available, you'll get the .com or .ai or whatever you want. Then they have this website builder. This is the one I'm gonna show you right here, this GoDaddy website builder. This starts at $10 a month. And if you look at the different plans, these are the different plans they have available. So if you're doing e-commerce, this is what you're gonna wanna buy. And they have bundles that come with multiple different things. So sometimes you're gonna want email marketing, you're gonna want the website builder. So you can see this as the website builder, this as the domain, starts at $10 a month. So this is the one I typically recommend, this essential domain bundle. So you get all the different things you need in one place. Now, when you get the website builder here after you buy yourself a domain, this mm -hmm. lets you use AI, will instantly create a logo, website, and more with, I have just this fake website, How Express, futuring, and then you'll type in exactly what you want. Mm -hmm. Okay, so super easy for this one, and then just say, got it right here. And this literally creates everything all in one place. So it creates a logo, it creates all the different things you need for your website, it even lets you register an LLC if you're starting a new company. So this has a ton of stuff built in inside of GoDaddy. So you could see the steps. Here's how to set this up. The domain, the website, it has marketing even built into it. So it'll help you do that. So if you want an all-in-one solution for your business, this has a lot more to offer. So it makes it really easy to like apply for an LLC, which a lot of the other ones don't focus on things like that. So this is good for an all-in-one solution, but the other ones, if you're trying to build a website, might be better if you don't need all these bells and whistles that come with GoDaddy. But again, worth exploring these for your business to see which one's a good fit. That's why I wanted to show you the top five in one video to make it really easy and simplify your research. Okay, next on the list, we have Squarespace, and this is one of those all-in-ones too. So you get your domain here, you get your hosting here, and it's a website builder. You get all of that in one place, and they have a ton of templates. I actually like a lot of these templates that they have. So right here, you could choose from all kinds of different categories. Let's choose marketing for this example. Let's press next. What do you wanna do? You wanna sell products, you wanna build a community. I wanna sell a service, a marketing service here. You could build with AI and then you could browse from templates to different options. I'll show you this AI option right here. 
And right over here, you could choose your website titles. I'm gonna call this one Website Helpers. It's gonna be professional. I'm gonna press next. Now, what do I wanna to add to the homepage? I want an intro section here. I want a product section. I want a service section. Look at this is creating it here. I want about a section and I want a footer section. And what kind of color do I want? Let's go with, let's see which one. Oh, this one's recommended. I like this one. Let's go with next. And you could change your fonts over here and you could just see exactly what each one looks like. This is actually a very popular one. I like this one for professional. And now it's gonna to go to work and it's gonna go ahead and generate your website. So again, one of the easier website builders with these new AI tools that are built into these. And there we go, we got ourselves a website. Again, I'm gonna look at it on mobile view as well to see if it looks good on mobile view. It's probably needs a little help on top actually on the mobile view. It looks a lot better on desktop than it does on mobile. So you could go ahead and press edit right on top. And again, with all these, this, these are really, these AIs are making the templates. They're not gonna get you a website that's good to go. You could see the prompt, there's not enough there for you to do that right now. So you'll have to go in and anything you want is editable. So you select any text, you double click any images here, you could go ahead and replace and it's gonna let you upload files. They have ton of stock images too available. So this is all about marketing. So let's say this is probably a better fit than what it picked for me. So I could go ahead and replace the background image in a second. That's a little bit better. And this starts with the free trial here to make sure you get your website up and running. And then when you're happy, you could go ahead and subscribe to this one. And this one, these are the different plans that are available. $23 a month, this is the best one I think for most people. This is the recommended option. This is gonna have the Squarespace AI to help you build that. But you can see all kinds of different things that come with this one. And if you wanna take anything related to payments, it will show you that too. So this is one of the good ones when it comes to taking any type of e-commerce type of a business and putting it on Squarespace. The next one I wanna show you is designed very specifically for e-commerce called Shopify, by far the most popular platform for e-commerce websites. Okay, this is the last on our list and Shopify, you probably heard of Shopify before, it's a massive company, thousands, hundreds of thousands of businesses that are e-commerce based are built on Shopify. So if you're selling any kind of physical product that you need to ship, I highly recommend Shopify over the other ones. A lot of other ones are better though, if you are not doing e-commerce. If you're not doing e-commerce, I actually recommend some of the other ones like Hostinger is a really good one for that. I showed you that in the beginning, very easy to use and very inexpensive. Now Shopify is gonna be the most expensive on the list of websites that I showed you because again, it's designed specifically to help you sell physical products. Now this one's one of the most popular ones to help you get started and as you scale up, you wanna to move to the different tiers and they make these rates a little bit cheaper as you increase this monthly price. So you can see by the time you get to this point, you slowly grow your business to this point and then the fees get cheaper here as you go up. So the more you sell, the more these plans start to make sense. And I'll put a link in the description where your first month is just a dollar. So you could try any of these plans for just a dollar. And then if you don't feel like it's a good fit or if it's too expensive or it doesn't fit your business, you could cancel and it just cost you a dollar. Now, typically Shopify works a little bit differently than the other website builders because it's based on products. So you usually start with adding different products. You'll title it, you give a description. They have ton of AI tools available too. You upload your images, you give it a price, and then you build yourself your entire product category first. So usually I'll start in the product tab or create these different collections or these different inventories that will become basically your entire product page. And then when you create your online store, you could go ahead and customize it here. They have different themes available. And with these different themes, you could then decide how that catalog, that inventory looks on the outside. So I'll show you these different themes they have available down here. And they have free themes, so a lot of these are gonna be free, and they have paid themes. So they have this thing called the theme store. That's the layout and the template kind of for your website. And they have it for all kinds of different categories. So I'll show you, let's click on this one, is a nice one. So you can see the premium ones sometimes are worth it. This is $380, and the design is really nice. So as long as you have your products already set up, it pulls it in automatically into this section over here and it creates the rest of your website for you. So, and a really interesting way to use some of these paid things and not pay for a website designer to make it really look nice for you. But again, they have a ton of free ones available. So if I just click on free, they have 13 free available. So if I wanted to sell similar type of products, 
here's what a free version of that would look like. And I could go ahead and view this store right here. And you can see this looks really nice as well. And this is completely free. I could add videos, everything's available here. I could click on an item to see more about it and add it to cart. So this is designed again for e-commerce, one of the best platforms for that. And for this one, I created a very complete tutorial that shows you all the different things you need to do to set up a Shopify store from scratch. So I'll link that with everything else that I've mentioned throughout this video. Hopefully this saves you some time in your research. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.